After a difficult year for eateries across New York, Restaurant Week is back in person. And just three days in, they're already feeling the boost in sales. New York is finally opening back up. People are feeling a little bit safer. They're definitely coming to visit us more. So that has definitely been a difference. And I hope to see that we keep on with the same track. In January, the city held a takeout only restaurant week. An in-person restaurant week couldn't have come soon enough. A successful restaurant needs approximately 90% to pay its bills. And very few restaurants are doing that 90% of their prior sales. Before restaurant week, good enough to eat had been averaging about 80% of usual sales, up from the 10% they did at the height of the pandemic, but still not enough. Jeremy Vladis, president of the restaurant group, said he's hopeful the event will supplement those sales. But we'll get a few people that normally or didn't know about us are now knowing about us or, or they're coming out of different neighborhoods to come visit the, uh, our establishments. To help restaurants along the road to recovery, Restaurant Week is longer this year, five weeks instead of four. More than 500 restaurants are taking part in the event this summer. The Delivery Restaurant Week was a huge success for neighborhood restaurants like Good Enough to Eat. It was tremendous because the standard neighborhood restaurants, uh, which we primarily are, um, really took advantage of the situation because people were staying close to their home in the neighborhood. And now they're working hard to make this restaurant week just as successful. From now until August 22nd, participating restaurants are offering $21 and $39 lunches and dinners, deals they hope will be irresistible.